We're going to start with news of Trump's indictment. Josh. Yes, it's the sad day uh, for mm. us all. Uh, I thought this would upset you. Yes. Are you being sarcastic? No, are you? I was crying in the break. Oh, my God, I can't believe you forget so easily. Uh, Former president indicted over efforts to overturn the 2020 US election. This has been obviously going on now for a while. But, uh, yes, four counts uh, by the grand jury. Uh, He says it's going to be happening, I think, is it tomorrow? And it's going to happen pretty soon as well, I think Thursday. So given uh, that... Trump has a tendency of spinning this kind of thing as well. This is evidence that we have a sort of deep state yeah. judiciary that's working or against him. Or evidence I committed or, a crime. Or the weaponization of the law enforcement system mm. against him and that that plays well with his base. Is yeah. this not a gift to Trump? Well, he's supposedly sent 40 million so far on lawyers and he's desperate for more money. So, yes, I imagine that more people will continue to donate. And two things can be true. It can be that people are out to get him and it can be that he committed crimes. Leo, we're not going to speculate on whether or not he committed the crime. That's the judge of the, the job of the jury. Yeah. I'm going to but, say it. But um, am I not right that there is a, an extent to which this could play into his hands? Oh, absolutely. I mean, he's, he's got this uh, grievance complex, which is mostly nourished by uh, reality, uh, because he is being persecuted. He's a political distant being persecuted by a government, by a, a political party. The Democrats have, have worked hand in hand with uh, parts of the government that are supposed to be at arm's length before uh, to, to persecute him or to or to, to fix things behind the scenes, like when they buried the Hunter Biden laptop story, or when they, they delisted people on, on Twitter who were his, his supporters. So, I mean, he, yeah, absolutely plays into his hands. I just don't, don't think, I mean, um, he's, he's not the best candidate for the Republicans, so it's almost, it's a shame that this is Isn't it strange him. that Ron DeSantis is out, but effectively he's out the race now, yeah. and yet, from a Republican point of view, if you, if you had half a brain, you would want him to yeah. run because he's far more but likely to He can win. It's a cult. Just like people would say that I have derangement syndrome, the people who are pro Trump also have the same derangement syndrome in that, that he can do no wrong. He, it's impossible that he actually but, committed but they a must crime. Look at the, they must know that he can't beat Biden. Yeah, and also, he lost last time. And also, I'm pro-Trump, but, I mean, uh, he's lost me on certain things, like his support for, for Ukraine. Uh, he, he doesn't support Ukraine in, in the way that he should. And the way that he should is somebody who supports, you know, Western liberal democracy and sees the entire Western world as, as brothers should. So my understanding of this is, though, that he can still run even if yeah. he's found guilty. Is he that right? in jail. Yeah. Yeah, there's no law that stops you from... Isn't uh, there a law at some point, because one of these charges is about assisting insurrection. If you can still run when you've done that... I think what they'll do is they'll, <laughs> they'll paint bars on the White House. And is that's that how they're going to do it? it. Yeah. I mean, that just strikes me as insane. Yeah. It's, it's America, mate. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah it does, but, uh, And also the, the 2020... I mean, it's ridiculous for them to say it was, a, it was an insurrection. I mean, it wasn't. It was a sort of stag do that got out of hand by the looks of it. I mean, they were, they were following guide, did, guide people rope. People did die. Yeah, people, people die in they all kinds of situations. It shows yeah. there's a two-tier justice system in America that people in the Antifa riots were sometimes compensated for being arrested, whereas, uh, whereas the people in this riot... We're, we're not. And they were actually taking the riot to where it was going to do some good instead of just burning down random businesses. It'll be so Honestly, interesting to if see. You, if you want to do an insurrection, you generally need the US government on your side and then you can overthrow any government around the world. But I don't think any of us would, would support the idea of an insurrection, but it just strikes me as very odd that if he is implicated in this, if it is determined yeah, that, yeah. He was, that he could still run. And, and what will that do? Because we thought last time, after, after he won in 2016, everything kind of spiralled in very strange ways in the world of American politics. It would be even weirder... <laughs> Yeah. At this point, if we... If and that's we, why we're going to be tuned in. Oh, I know, but <laughs> I just, doesn't anyone else just crave some normalcy? No. I just want a good yeah. few years of normal, boring yeah. vote, vote but, politics. But that's what Biden was supposed to be, and look but what he's, he's done. Yeah. He's every, everybody, you know, half the people in his government are transgender, and it's, you know, I don't know, it's nuts.